Hello, hello everyone. How are you all doing tonight? Ah, hello. Um, hello Shinra0295. Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the, to the network. Hello, Kenny. D yeah, hello, Kenny. Hello, Jinyu. Hello, Jude. It is great to see y'all. How are you all doing tonight? As usual, I am joined by the wonderful, delightful, um, SD Nova Infinity, Nikki Riesel, and Jude Cryobite. How are all of you too? Hello. Hi. Hi, everyone. Forgot to turn on that source. Hi. I'm doing good. Hello, Gordon. Hello, ah, Gordon. Hello, Gordon. Tell us all just, uh, yeah. Yeah. Um, a tale as old as time, Kenny versus Twitch app, yeah. Uh, imagine <laughs> Twitch if Twitch app is still garbage. Imagine Twitch if Twitch app is pretty pretty garbo. Imagine if Twitch was good at making things. <laughs> How do I import a widget from a file for OBS? Um. Uh, what from kind a file, of file um, are we like from about? an HTML file or a link. Um. Do you have a link or an HTML it file? A it is a widget file, specifically. Um... Base OBS, I don't think, can do those. Those are Streamlabs OBS exclusive. What are you trying to carry over? Um... The viewer account. Uh, go to the... Um, yeah. I'm gonna send the link in voice text for where you want to go to set that up. You're gonna make it as a Still browser view. Oh. Oh. Okay, but I did that wrong then. Yeah. Oh, hi, Matt Eiffy. Yeah, uh, are we gonna kill some gods? Hello, Flamomorpho as well, yeah. We're already all level 100 in the JRPG? Yeah, that's great. Let us make the bare bones of game idea I had if I understand it right. Yeah, I'm planning to. I used to think it was pronounced Godot, yeah. Me too, honestly. Then I, like, actually learned about where it's from, but yeah. Hello, Warcraft Taker. Welcome back. Yeah. Uh. Tonight, I am gonna be just generally messing around with that, sh and which should be fun. Uh. And tonight, I'll be working on the story. Ooh, so nice. It's nice, gonna nice. be nice and chill today. Yay. I have yeah. some uh. lo fi music and some gentle rain sounds in the background, and uh, we'll just be hanging out and talking about stuff tonight while I'm working on this. Oh, and uh, take your medication, everyone. Yep, take your meds. Hello, uh -uh. Stella. As for my side of things, I don't know. I didn't. I don't know what I wanted to do. I wanted to play one game, but I realized I cannot stream that game, unfortunately, due to it being terribly optimized. Yeah. And it makes uh -huh. my system unstable, so I cannot stream it. So I decided that I will just be doing whatever comes to mind at the time. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh. I don't know who your friends on the stream are, actually. I usually just watch your solo stuff. These are my uh, my girlfriend, SD Nova Infinity, my girlfriend, uh, Nikki Riesel, and our chaperone, Jude Cryobite. Hello. Uh, yeah, we made a cute sprite for the Undertale soul that can dash and stuff. Ooh, nice sun roses. Great to see you, by the way. But yeah, mm -hmm. uh, you, yeah. <laughs> yeah, this is um... Parallel Play, where... We aren't actually doing anything together. We're just doing our own stuff and hanging out and having a good time. And speaking of, I should probably go and do that. So let's head on over. Um, I'm going to do something I shouldn't do, but I will do anyways. Which we is, I'm going to show, I'm going to show the document on screen while Ooh, I'm typing it. Fun. Just so everyone knows what's up. But yeah, uh, you we'd love to see... Yeah. That should be enough. Uh, a couple things. Uh, one, we'd love to join in on go. that sometime. Yeah, that'd be nice. Sometimes we have a bit more open nights. I usually try and keep it to like just four people total in the chat because otherwise it gets to be a bit too like noisy and chaotic with folks talking over each other and I just can't really manage that super well. But mm -hmm. yeah, we don't. Mm. Not all of us are always able to come by, and sometimes I have, like, j I, like, up the limit to five or six or so, but yeah. Also, I've got a redeem from Kenny. Thank you for the blocks. Hey. I've got a... Uh, oh. 
Doe's not showing. Why isn't it show? Oh, I just have it hidden. Wop wop. <laughs> Talk time game that. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. No. Tonight. Yeah. Um. Uh, yeah. We're. Yeah. Ali Alicia's basically gotten like the summary of it. Love the wops. Yeah. The wops are great. Yeah. Yeah. Alicia's got a good summary of it. Uh. Project name. Yeah, I'm yeah. just calling it God Slayers. Uh. It is. <laughs> yeah. Just as a working like title. Uh, it is a top-down game that takes MMO raids and strips, strips away the MMO half. So you get right to the raid content without having to do much else. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Good. Sounds fun. Yep. Yeah. <clears throat> this is the fourth project you're working on right now? Um... This is no, uh, oh. that you was a notice. Yeah, own... yeah. That girl who streams games. Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the network. Yeah, mm -hmm. with the name reminds us of two things: the God Hunter album from Aviators and the God Seeker DLC for Hollow Knight. Yeah, it is just a working title, not like a text proper name or anything. Bigger. Sure. Um. Hello, Jimmy Long. Welcome to the Nexus. I mean, um, yeah. you know what? How about I just do this? Yeah, generally I should just um say a no, couple things. Not. Yeah, wonder if Discord would let me join any voice chat since right now I'm at the West Coast for a bit. I'll try that later. Yeah, we are at capacity for the voice chat tonight, but yeah. Bing Games working titles before, just Kenny, or... digital, so better than I. Yeah. Was that Jude? No, I was just mentioning oh. since Kenny's connection is pretty bad right now, mm -hmm. they weren't able to watch my streams yesterday, yeah. really. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah. yeah, Reef, this being my fourth project, this is more of like just, you know, like, this is, oh. yeah, like, this isn't going to be probably as intensive as the other ones. Right now, the main thing I'm doing is trying to learn how to use Godot, because that's going to be important for other projects. And yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, let me just do something real quick, Ziona. Let me move all this, um, let me move everything over. No. <laughs> ah, okay, so... Which isn't gonna be too hard. Canvas look. Yeah, I'm just making... Yeah, I'm... I should grab some, like, my itch assets or stuff just so I have, like, something to use for it. So... Good work, yeah. I'm not actually sure how, like, Godot sprite frames and such work. Uh... I should probably just pull up the Godot engine, like, docs and everything. <laughs> Might be Wonder. important. Alright, so, yeah. Learn. Uh, that should... that should do. Documentation is generally useful, yeah. Uh, okay, that should fix things. Let me just move the microphone aside. Like there. And then coffee can go over here. Alright. You bake there. it, then it becomes go bread. <laughs> <laughs> Bad understatement, oh. Jude. I can't use chat without lag. If I turn off audio, only all hell breaks loose. Oof, yeah. Mm -hmm. I am bread. And let me just like, but it's like, ah, uh, let me check my itch asset back. To answer your question, Janine, I am doing well. But yes, I should probably get in the rhythm of doing that as well for parallel play. I am joined by Nikki Rusol, Jude Cryobite, and Lemma EOF. Hello there, Nexus mm -hmm. viewers. Yo, yeah, uh, Lemma's occasionally, <laughs> Alicia! God damn it, Alicia. <laughs> I wish I could see your chats because now I have to know what was just said. <sighs> just want to make sure that nothing is cut out in this. Ace. Uh, I am bread only if you need to be. Okay. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm bread only if you want to be? Yeah. We have at least three tabs of the CYF docs open at all times and working our fan game and sometimes also a couple tabs for the library references. Yeah. Here, have a bread box since you wouldn't be bread so badly. God. <laughs> 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 
having a great oh, no. start today, huh? That's Sundays. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Coming so strongly out of the gate, we'll lose steam too quickly. <laughs> Love that joke. <laughs> well, unfortunately for unfortunately for you, I have multiple batteries for this exact purpose. <laughs> I can oh. keep making these jokes all night. I can confirm like she can. Energizer, buddy. Uh, okay. You just keep going and going and going. I don't remember how many commercials used to be. You're cute, yeah, Brad Box. <laughs> um, <laughs> Brad Box. Alright, uh, let's see if I can just like pull a couple of these in. This work? Yes! Nice! Poggers. Then, um. That might also be cool because. What do you got, actually? Um. Whoa. Let me actually yeah. just open these up in a sprite, Whoa. like in my own view, so I can, like. Just so I can, like, have an idea of what I'm working with. Okay, yeah, so. Yeah. Have animation. Just for safety reasons. Thank you for the lurk, Oko. Oh. Right, Jared's gonna spawn on your island now. I'm sorry? Uh, Jared's gonna just spawn naturally yeah. on your island now. Oh, good. Oh, soft, adorable, chubby robot. Yeah, soft, adorable, chubby robot friend who deserve kisses. <laughs> I'm also good at loot jokes, we would be good friends, yeah. Uh, Alicia is, ah, uh, genuine, like, wonderful sweetheart. Yeah. Um, so, like, if I make a, um, add a, just, like, right, okay. Then, oh, you can do... Load? Yeah. And like, open, and then can you crop that? Oh, wow. Yeah, so I just... It's very weird to know that people can see how well I type. <laughs> Which is not fast, but eloquent. <laughs> Turn the jams up a bit? Sure. Ah, uh, short. That's, uh, it's too choppy. Yeah. I got 15 minutes before I have to check in, so I'm gonna head out. It's always nice to hear y'all keep voice before I go. Oh, yeah. Couldn't learn tabs like CUIF docs, CUIF docs, CUIF docs, CUIF docs, CUIF docs. Twitter, like five tabs of unrelated math nerdery, five tabs of YouTube, the stream, mood. Did Kado just crash? <laughs> Would you, we're out of sprites. Would you prefer sound up? Okay. Oh, well, uh, the fire girl got my friend's video muted not too long ago. Yeah, I'll take the risk. It's nothing important. It's literally just songwriting or story writing right now. Not hydrate, thank crucial. you, Sun Roses. <sighs> um, is Godot okay? I follow the I follow the rules and regulations. I have Lo-Fi Girl credited in my panels, so I've That's done everything they asked me to. So if they still have issue with that, then so be it. Oh. So, how big? And um, whole thing is two twenty-five by ninety-six. Okay. Or, yeah. Let me do a sippy. <laughs> uh. Slurp. Slurp. How about we are, uh. Here, uh, I got. Here, I, I got you with the slurp. You had a bogey in C7. God. Um, hello, Catton! The does? Is Godot okay? Is Godot going slow? Um, it keeps stopping responding. 
Ah, uh, so it's Blender. Um. Premiere Pro. Uh, Photoshop. <laughs> so, uh, just Adobe products in general. Adobe yeah. products in general. Godot is basically an Adobe product right now. No, it's not. It's not stealing money from you. That's valid. Not what I meant. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I know it's not what you meant, but... Uh, oh, there. Um, I think it's whenever I hit tabs that... Uh, we're enabled. Evil glowy eyes. Alright, so... How many... So... Nineteen... Aha! There you are! Blue. Yeah, now we've got a bunny! Banui! Does this excellent blender? No. Seems it doesn't like whatever you're doing yet. Um, it freezes whenever I hit the tab key, so I think that's what's causing it. Um, let me pull up a link I sent. Yep. Yeah. Ooh, Blobs! Thank you, Alicia! Blobs, Blobs. Uh, where is... GodotShaders.com, yeah. And this item... That's not the right one. I'm gonna make a standard material <clears throat> or canvas item material, yep. This is Uh, how do I... Oh. Cool. Hmm. Huh. Think about, um, diff thinking different rules will have different outlines on their top-down stripe, probably using the F14 roll colors. That way you always know where the healers and tanks are. Yeah, that'd be good. Just trying to figure out, um, this, uh, how do you, all right, that's enough Animal Crossing for now. I'm very lost on what the hell I'm doing. Um, <laughs> like, what am I doing? Actually, uh, I should probably, um, Like hitting 
same shit. Okay, go. How do you, like, actually go? Material, new shader material, okay. Ah, new shader material, got it. So. Let's, so like, um, real new shader material. Ooh. New shader. Um. Click on the sphere that appears, okay. Then what? Um, shader, new shader. Click on the new shader resource in the editor will open. Aha! That should hopefully work. Um... I will be back in a few minutes. Alright. Alrighty. No problem. Uh, I don't know if that works. Um, looks like Python with funk instead of def. Yeah. Um. It. Yeah. It basically is. Hello, null pointer. What are you trying to do? Yep. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. I am. Uh, trying to figure out how this uh pre-supplied shader I got works. Um. So yeah. I turn off region that whoa okay does something yeah trying to figure out ah I think this shader I yeah I've grabbed might not be working. Or, oh, it needs a texture, okay. Ah, it needs a texture. Oh, I required three people for this? I thought I could do this solo. No. Well, that's a shame. I mean, that's not a problem. I just thought I could do it solo. Maybe that was changed recently. Maybe. Hmm. Uh, who's Generic that? Generic store corner? brand energy drink. Ah. The uh, cat in, in the bottom right corner is SD Nova. Yep. That's SD Nova Infinity. Alright, so I can just use an outline texture, which. Yeah. Thus, you are not so local from another timeline, Singularity Dragon. Mm hmm. The moon is haunted. Or so I am told. Mm hmm. Like every game. I apologize for any drops in performance of the stream. That's alright. Oh, it's just because... A little unstable. Yeah. Oh, good there. I think it might... Hmm. Is it something I can, oh. like... Oh. Oh, did I not import it properly? Mm. Ah. Um. Ah. Yeah. Thank you. 
Atlas, yeah. Oh. Ah, restart. Okay. I mean, it did. There we go. Um. How about, um, open a file manager just so I can, like, do this properly, so. Downloads. There. Now let's do, yeah. I have one of those gel guns. My gun's ammunition is a weird gel. Hmm. Hmm. Does it at least slow people down? No. It just it, it transfers the gel into elemental energy, or so I assume. I do not know the logistics of this weapon, but I like it. Right. Rebooting again. Uh we good? Oh, well, that was incredibly rude. Enemies is also 32 by 32? Yeah. Right. Ouch. And again, just doing straight sprite work. Nice, nice, yeah. Okay. Alrighty. Hi. Welcome back, babe. Welcome back. Mm-hmm. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <sighs> I'm kind of liking how this chapter is going. Uh, right, but... Oh, it's a Since this is a texture array, um... What can I do about that? So... Uh, should I just screen share this for you? Not if you wanna. I'll, I want to know. I want to know your thoughts on this paragraph. I don't actually know what I'm doing here. How about I just um? Um, if I screen share, you might get music. I'm just gonna screen cap it and send it. That one. Oh, yeah. Captain just... Seven Thousand, thank you for the follow. Welcome oh, to the Hi. Hello, Captain. Great to see you. Okay. If I, I just... sent the par I sent the paragraph to voice text. Documents. So, I just make a Benui dot PNG. All right. Uh-oh. You like my lore? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Where did Benoit PNG go? It is oh, a dark I... story, but I think everyone has a dark story to tell. Yeah. I totally don't have a dark story to tell. What are you talking about? <laughs> I was built for no, puddles. I'm not currently 23,000 words into my own lore. What are you talking about? <laughs> Just wait till they hit 25. Oh no, I am. There's a reason I'm writing this during NaNoWriMo. Is oh. <laughs> because I actually believe that if I oh. spent all of November writing this, I could hit 50,000 words. Before quote unquote 5.0 happened. Yeah. I was built for cuddles. And you're very good at them. <laughs> very, very good. Yay. There's enough, there's enough cuddle for at least two androids, we know that much. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but we do know that the maximum is eight. Not androids, but just humanoids in general. Mm -hmm. So. The maximum number of simultaneous cuddles? Did I hear that wrong? You got it right. Alright, now how the hell do I make this not blurry? 
Because I can, I, I am sure that I can do at least triple that, though, given the, the actual size of my wings. Blurry. You could, you could probably hit a scale of 100 in your, in your true <laughs> form. Let's be honest. I possess um, limitless potential. Oh. I want to turn oh. off... Turn off filter, okay. Turn off filter. Re-import. Boom! Better! Yay! Woo! Doing the filter interpolation thing. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, Did he die? Oh. Uh, posture check. Oh. Thank you, son. Roses! Ah, yeah, we love having Loria. Laura's fun. My lore is that I was, uh, built to satisfy the, the softest robot sexual archetype and dominate the marketplace something something that weird copy pasta that went around recently. <laughs> <laughs> no, that, that, oh, no, that tracks. That tracks. Yeah. <laughs> I uh, think it succeeded. Hello, I have a monopoly on, um, softest robot. <laughs> What does that mean? That's up to your interpretation. The softest robot NFT? No. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, no. <laughs> no. No. None of us. None of us here. None of you us You mean here the softest would. robot beanie baby? That's... You know what? Yes. Beanie babies. Okay, but are we talking about 90s beanie baby? Or modern day beanie baby? Because they look terrible now. God, right, they're still making them, aren't about... they? Honestly, Lemma would a thousand percent have been a Webkins. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's a callback. God, Webkins. Uh, I don't know. I mean, I mean those I think, thighs I do look pretty soft, to be fair. <laughs> they call yeah. me Floppy Feet. God. <laughs> I'm Floppy Feet, sense of responsibility. Hint, she's very bad at her job. I'm the female body inspector. God! <laughs> Alright, thanks! Uh. Judging by your bonus structure, I'd say you're halfway there. <laughs> Alright, import. Turn off filter for the slime. Uh, um, I understand gonna... your time one means. I get it. Hi, Banshee. Outline. I'm gonna get you, little girl. I don't know what you identify as, and I want to make sure that I'm not overstepping any boundaries. Yeah, I'm experimenting with they them right about now. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm actually think. Yeah, I think I'm kind of going more by they man these days. All right, cool, great to know. <laughs> nice, nice. Yeah, oh man. Uh, the fan also, we made a cool wonderful. animation for the heart dashing, but we have to redo it for all four directions as is. Ah, yeah. Slime.png. Why are you still filtered? I said turn off. Yeah. Filter off on slime PNG, yeah. Slime.png. Are you ready for slime? It's time for slime. If the answer is no, you're a liar. Shout outs to, uh, shout outs to Nianners. God. Slime. slime incident. Oh, no. I, I showed you that video, didn't I? I no, think no. you did. Yeah. Yanners is the very living definition of Blurst. Yeah, no, very much. Blurst cat queen. Uh, and let's say you're gonna be like... Uh, that's and, a... <laughs> Speaking and... of beating me, shows... Shows, uh... Cold Steel videos. God. <laughs> Those are usually pretty fun to watch, to be fair. Yeah. yeah. Why is it filled with milk? God. <laughs> well, I really don't like how this game has such a problem loading its own hub. That's I don't have a problem with loading so... the hub, I have a problem with loading the maps. It might just be because it's on my 
hard disk drive and I should probably install it on my solid drive, but I need my solid drive for uh, Adobe. Because hmm. Adobe... Right there. <clears throat> Adobe literally cannot stand anything but a solid state drive if you're talking 32-bit. Mm -hmm. I think that was reference, yeah. Uh, you're joking, I can't tell Juice Bro preferred it. Yeah, oh, that was um, referencing... Um, let me pull the image up because it's a very funny image. Mm -hmm. I'm distracted by this big gun I have. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> That's Destiny 2 in a nutshell. Yeah. Whips out truth. <laughs> Whips out Xenophage. I can't, yes. hear, I, I can't hear you over the 50 cal anti-material slugs I'm firing yeah. at this right, demigod. Uh, yeah, uh, Kat, let me just pull this up because it is a... Oh, I thought of a way to make redoing the animation downwards more easy. Ooh. Yeah, uh, let me just... did a bit on this SVD today. Awesome. All right, Stella, thank you for joining. Take care. Uh, see you around. Yeah, Hi, no, Stella. uh, Kat, this is what I was referencing. I love it. It's just... Hey, I'm actually going by they man these days. Oh, cool! Thanks for letting me know! Yeah! Mm -hmm. uh, uh, that's, one, that's a great meme, though. It's Let's so good. Honest. It's so good. It's, you know, you know, you know what fucks me up, but... I, and I just hate it for no reason whatsoever. Yeah. It's the M1, it's the M1 Garand. Made by Garand. Interesting. He's just like, please refer to it as this. Uh, and it's just like, please refer to it as... I'm just like, why? Just go with your name. Garand sounds better. I like yeah. to remove the first A. It's called the M1 Grand. Because people think it's quite grand. Yeah, oh, cool. uh, it's, 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 it's pretty grand, except for the fact that you're playing the fucking lottery anytime you put a new clip in. I won the lottery! What did I win? Uh, sore thumb for the rest of your life. Yeah. Honestly, <laughs> honestly, no, but that is a video you should, you should watch, is, uh, there's a YouTube channel called, uh, Grand Thumb. That is, a uh, more or less kind of just, like, a weapons showcase thing. Um, and there's a video specifically that they dedicated to getting Grand Thumb, where they just all put a magazine in it uh, with the intention to get grand thumb why do you want this um because it, it's it's it, it a lot of people who know how to operate weapons use the modern way of inserting a clip when in world war ii you didn't like hold back the you didn't hold back the or you didn't hold down the bolt to make sure it didn't slide forward while you were loading mm -hmm. but in world war ii they didn't have that kind of training so they specifically they specifically did that in the old fashioned way, even though it's uh even though it's like a mild inconvenience at first, but it hurts like hell about the sixth or seventh time you do it. <laughs> <laughs> it's one of those that it's like it's like getting it's like getting calluses on your fingers after playing guitar long enough, but it's the opposite. It's like, oh no, the more you do it the worse it gets. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but it's basically just like it's a what is it? It's Let a spring load. It's that. a spring loaded bolt or a spring bolt. So it uh. it, cl it claps forward like like a mouse trap. <laughs> I'm trying I'm to sneak around, but I'm using an M1 Garand and the clap so, of it. One forty two to one thirty one. That's keeps alerting the guards. <laughs> I'm trying. I'm trying to sneak around. But I'm using an M1 Garand, and That's the ping of the okay, magazine, then. and the ping of the clip ejecting is alerting the guards. <laughs> a rookie holding a handgun has to worry about slide bite. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. No, I'm very aware of slide oh, bite. Trust me. <clears throat> I recall being told about how you have to, if you're using a revolver, you have to hold your hand in a very specific way, otherwise they gasp from, from the um the sh or the the bullet being hit will scorch your hand. Oh mm -hmm. no, depending on the caliber, it can be worse. Oh boy. Oh, oh, so you could say that you could burn your entire hand? Like catch no, on fire? No, worse. Uh, depending on the caliber of the revolver and where the gas uh, where the gas goes out. If you mm -hmm. have very poor grip and, and you like have your thumb in a place that it's not supposed to, if the caliber's high enough, there's so much gas going out there, you're losing that thumb. 
Oh. Or breaking your wrist, yeah. Why do people use guns? Just use swords. Mm -hmm. I think... <laughs> Ziona, any comments? <laughs> yeah. we, That's good go idea. Letting not be fully top down so you can see the heroes people are playing as. Yeah, I'm thinking of like the um, Zelda stuff. Like just um, normally like a top down game, you think of like Zelda or such. Yeah, let me just pull up like a reference image. Yeah, so like just normally a top down game is kind of from like a three quarters perspective instead. Like just shrugs and multi arrow weapons. Yeah, like <laughs> think like Legend of Zelda, um, like yeah, like top down 2D Legend of Zeldas or whatever. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Get sneeze. Mm hmm. Uh, no. Yeah. Yes. No. <laughs> <laughs> this is why I say that Brat Box would be a really good um name for a group if we had one. Welcome to the Brat Box. Dorks. <laughs> You're dorks, though. Brat in the Box. It's like Jack in the Box. Mm -hmm. You get a uh, very bratty, cheaty VTuber on a random gotcha roll. God. Climb, you're gonna use a texture of load radiant oh, enemy. Yeah. Hello, I like this bow. There. They'll probably stand to make the gradients a bit more aggressive, but yeah. Oh, that's but yeah, then like do. just, okay. uh, excuse me, the plural of legend, um, the plural is the legends of Zelda. <laughs> uh, <laughs> the legend of Zeldas. And how about there are legend? multiple Zeldas, so I mean, uh, that, yeah. that makes yeah. more sense. When you're dealing with like, the bullshit timeline, there are, um, like, seven Zeldas. I love how, I like, the Zelda... Zelda... I do love how the Zelda timeline exists pretty much exclusively to troll people at this point. Like, the official Dark one. Zelda, you mean Hilda? Mm -hmm. Yes, God <laughs> Zelda. Yeah. Hot I, I have a Zelda. sense for her, I'm not gonna lie. She's quite nice to look at. I like the dark hair, I like her... I like her Raven from Teen Titans uh, personality. Huh. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I mean, honestly... Forget Zelda. I, I want more games with with uh, Twilight Midna. Yeah. Oh, Twilight Midna is great. Yeah. Okay. Here's a here's a very here's a very big question that will that I will judge you if you have the wrong answer for jokingly, but I will do it. Uh -huh. Um, is Tetra Zelda? Yes, but no. Because the answer is no. <laughs> The answer is yes, but no. Tetra is Tetra is a descendant of Zelda, so it's yes. technically te so technically Tetra is Zelda. Tetra is Isekai Zelda. Fight me. Yeah, <laughs> basically, basically, Tetra is it, it's first name Tetra, last name Zelda, because yeah. by technicality she is a descendant of the Zelda family. She just goes well, by a by a first yeah. name or a nickname. I mean, to be she's fair, the Zelda the Zelda minute. family is named Hyrule, so like her, yeah. Technically, her name. I was going to ask. Yeah, Daphne's an assassin ask, Hyrule. Was Zelda the surname. You yeah, know, uh, the last name is like the king's name in Wind Waker is Daphne Snowhassen. No, Daphne Snowhansen Hyrule. That's You're right. Yeah. yeah. Makes sense. Yeah. Like, yeah. It's, it's that in like Four, like, that Risk in... Or Auto Attack. And, and it's also, and it's also uh, King Hyrule in, uh, yep. in uh, Breath of the Wild. So, yeah. yeah technically, mm -hmm. last name is Hyrule. You got me there. I like this yeah. bow. This bow is very nice. Yeah, um... How do I Does do... Does it pull all the right strings for you? <laughs> I hate that, but yes. What, what the mean? answer is yes, but I hate that. That's I said, I like mean. this bow, and Jude responds with, does it pull all the right strings for you? <laughs> Honestly, my favorite Zelda is, is uh, Hello, Link Hello, hello, Gloria Guitar. Great to see ya. Ah. No, why has that removed the top half of the body structure? Wow. Uh, what? Um, <laughs> I'm fiddling around with a new v and I'm seeing how making a new avatar in it would be. Mm -hmm. And I just erased the sleeves on the sweater, and they've removed everything above, like, 
the waist and in between the sh like in between where your waist is down to about the bottom third of your arm yeah <laughs> well, I yeah probably just I um <clears throat> as, as I mentioned I just... previously um, I am commissioning I am commissioning uh, Azazel to make a v6 model but I'm giving her ample time to <laughs> figure out the the new update because it does change a lot of the workflow yeah while there's a some things. lot of stuff yeah uh yeah. I'm still there's still stuff I am let's say salty about but it does look good yeah it, 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 yeah. it I mean honestly top top time yeah I have bad it news. Oh. It takes less time with the new V-Roid to make this quality model, which mm -hmm. is good. Yeah. I'm addicted to FF14. Fucking rip! Oh, rip. See you later. See you in six months. <laughs> you're never coming out of it. Yep, Once see you, you in that locker. Once you get started, you're never coming out. They have you yep. now. Yep. They had you, but they had you at the word bunny girl. Yeah. <laughs> uh... Do you like Nier and Nier Automata? Congratulations, they've got you. Yeah. Need to... It's still very strange being told that's canon, but then again, yeah. you look at my lore and it's like, I guess. Was it, was it, it Cat Girl actually bit yeah. that? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's canon. Like he yeah. said that anything that touches Nier Automata makes it canon. Yeah. Woo! So that is indeed because I am canon. Whoa, awesome. whoa, whoa! Artemis! Artemis the Beer Queen, thank you for subscribing at tier one for 12 months! Ah! We did it! Woo! One, year, baby. one full year of simping, yay! Now, <laughs> shrimping, yeah, uh, shrimping. Yeah, thank yeah. Can't you. Can't use, can't use this to refer to other people. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, because it was targeted at meh. Because it was like primarily targeted at men, and that made the people, that made the men who run Twitch very, very upset. It made them very ah, angry. Yes. Insecure, insecure. How how dare how dare they have feelings? What snowflakes? Piano, yeah, uh, piano. Yeah, it is great to see you here, Artemis. Yeah, ah. Uh, yeah, I'm Artemis over here is my a being taken away lovely. It was yeah. like pulling teeth to get a tag. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah. Hope y'all are doing good. Uh, yeah, ah. Uh, yeah, I am. Messing around with Godot and learning how the hell it works, and I still have no idea how the hell it works, but oh well. <laughs> I'm figuring it out. Uh, how does control node? What is a control node actually? Oh wait, this is for UI, not for actual like. Um. Inputs. Inputs. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah, so... No, but you're a robot. How do you have such bad aim? Listen, if the androids of my time don't use guns. Input. That's why. And e. Guns are barbaric. Yeah. God's the running game, so yeah. they're elegant mm -hmm. and neat. Yep. Yeah. I love... Lovely, Emma. Yeah. Artemis, you are very lovely, yeah. So... Meanwhile, yeah. I'm over here with a custom-made rifle. We're just like, hmm, cute. Yes. Let's see, let's see what that, let's see what that sword does at 500 meters. Ah. Yeah, uh, ah. Need to work on what my lore is gonna be, yeah. I mean, I, d like, just, I am one of those VTubers who doesn't have any lore beyond, I am a robot who was built for cuddles. Yep. Teleports behind you, nothing personnel, kid. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, so you. I feel like for this game, I'd be like a writer and character designer, along with like generally doing testing and kit design, helping and stuff. Yeah, like just you'd be on the design side, I'd be more on the implementation side, probably. I just hit a 69,000 exactly, uh, nice. crit. That makes me happy. Nice. I mean, yeah. you you say you say that you could just teleport behind me and kill me instantly. Yeah. Also, need to commission lemma for my model. I yeah. can dis Listen I can dismantle yourself. your entire advance yeah. by complimenting how good you look. <laughs> yeah. Wait, are you actually making God Slayer game? I am definitely like just Alicia has nerd sniped me into at least giving it a good try. Mm -hmm. So much. When are you gonna tell me you were making a game about me? <laughs> I mean, this is the first night I've started working on it. I've literally 
I literally don't know what I'm doing, so I'm trying to figure that out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Gloria. Yeah, you are. Yeah, I would love to help make a model for you. Yeah. I do need to learn new V-Roid, and as long as you're fine with me not like... Yeah. Like, just, there's a ton of new cool stuff in it, and as long as you're fine with out it being chubby, because that's still something I am dreading to do. Yeah. Put a ranged DPS archer with a pet bear into the game. Hell yeah. We want to make a dungeon oh, crawl that involves going down to some sort of twisted upside down Tower of Babel. Oh, that'd be great. Who's the cutest robot of Chicas? Oh! Cheating eyeball. Which key is that again? Um... That one? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Ah! Ah! Can you make it, what? uh, have a witch's hat? Uh, yeah, I actually, um, funny story, actually. <laughs> um... I actually, um, so y'all rem will remember, like, just, I made a Halloween version of my model. Like, mm -hmm. I ended up just having that be, like, um, edited, like, to be, like, um, just orange glow and everything. I did actually end up oh. buying a, like, 3D model of a witch's hat for that, but, uh, didn't end up using it. But I can definitely get you a witch's hat. Mm-hmm. Yeah, uh... Because she also have a club, of course, yeah. Like, Alicia is definitely gonna be, like, on the side of, like, designing the... Like, designing everything. And, yeah, I will be doing more of the code monkeying for it, because that's what I end up being really good at, honestly. Let me see if I can actually even, like, find that. Yeah, no, I do have, like, a witch hat FBX just lying around. Huh. Yeah, and let me know if you need any writers. Yeah, of course, of course, yeah. I'm thinking like the most straightforward healer character being like a sort of sci-fi medic who can latch onto the tank with the healing beam is very much inspired by the Starcry medic in Heroes of the Storm. Yeah, so like the like TF2 medic style heal heal beam thing. Yeah. So. Kind of a Diablo Hell Divers esque. Yeah. Let's go practice medicine. Help and harm. <laughs> right, so if if then then if you then uh, let me just make sure I know what I'm doing with like the uh right, so Yeah, just generally figuring out what I'm doing here, so... I want to redo that. Rest, okay, so properties... Is... Alright, so that is on the action, okay. Now, actually, I probably should make, like, another... Mean for this, but yeah, or another node. I hear someone outside has a small dick. Yeah, <laughs> oh god. Oh no, <laughs> the way that was delivered was so yeah. flat oh. and honest. Yeah, that, <laughs> that was ruthless. Yeah, that gonna watch some more video. Yeah. yeah, gonna uh. Watch some more video, talk to you later, nerd. See ya, Stone Roses. Great to have you around here. God, my for four, uh, teen character is the dumbest heck in glamour. Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, feel free to send me a pic, Gloria. Uh, that came from such yeah. a dark and honest place. Yeah. Uh, yeah, uh, <laughs> that, that is, that is, feeling that a is high... the look of someone who's been, a, yeah. who's been woken up at three oh my, in the morning. Yeah, oh my god, Alicia. Yeah. Screaming down their street. <laughs> what did I miss you somewhere? Else? I did. It's the cowboy. Oh yeah, the cowboy glamour. Oh, it's great. I'm just gonna yeah. Clip that for myself. Uh, 
Healing a high health DPS and having a line like, there, stop crying hey, now. <laughs> Did someone mention small dicks? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, small, I will say like just, for the record, small dicks are not a bad thing. Just, you got a small cis hat dick. men like really- the size of this not except way yeah. small. God, yeah, like, <laughs> small dicks are not a bad thing. They can be cute as hell. I just think it's hilarious how insecure cis hat men get about them. Yeah, nothing wrong with small dicks. There's something wrong with being insecure about it and making that someone else's problem. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Lemma saying that line made me feel things. Oh. Sunday night conversations <laughs> are wild. Yeah, yeah. welcome yeah. to Sunday night play. is Truthfully, uh, Parallel play is- clip. You're like just parallel play, aka the, the night where I'm on Adderall and don't give a shit. <laughs> yeah, this is um, this is this is where a lot of our a lot of our say so attitude goes yeah. to die. <laughs> yeah. Like just if as we long as if we weren't if we weren't lewd, we are today. There, stop crying now. <laughs> Pick a god and pray because it's Sunday, baby. <laughs> um, Pick a god and pray, and uh, it won't matter because I'm a god killer. <laughs> yeah. I mean, that is what I'm working on right now a game where you kill gods. Range GPS is gonna be fun like, playing like a twin stick shooter, yeah. <laughs> well, see if, like, like, just. At least my main concern with, like, twin stick is that the. I mean, you could maybe do it with, like, mouse, just, like. Twin stick is not the best for keyboard. Yeah. Got another yeah. god killer around? Yeah. The line made me feel things. So. The reason Jude is here to Sorry, chaperone I'm Yeah. Not, Hello, Nan! Great to see ya. Because I revel in the chaos. Mm -hmm. Our souls sing in the chaos. Yeah, okay, so. Our hearts. I don't remember. It's been a while. Ooh, input map. Neat, neat, neat. Okay. I should try out input map something. Uh. Oh, I had a hey, word in my you? head that I was going to write for this. Now I need to think about it. Okay. Alright, yeah. Underlord if you light. do, feel free to go get the packet. <laughs> yeah, sorry, I had to drop by to say hello. Yeah. Oh, I meant like the FC version of Twin Stick where it aims at mouse cursor and you walk around with Waz. Yeah, that sounds good. If that would, mm -hmm. yeah, like having it go to like strafe mode, yeah, that'd be great. Mm hmm. Right, now, fundamentally, right fundamentally, oh, fundamentally, your MMO has to have, well, quote unquote, MMO. If you're going for that style, you, you can't, you can't fuck up movement. It's like one of the most crucial things in raid content. Yeah. Besides mechanics. Mm hmm. But oh. if you just walk directly into the boss and die, then that helps no one. Mm -hmm. It does lead for some very funny mo moments, though. At least the first couple of times. After the third mm -hmm. one, it's like, okay, now I'm, now I'm getting upset. Uh, no, it's how, how dare. bar player. You're, you're wasting my time, so therefore I'm going to waste yours. Bar player, Bell. I oh, I nailed that you. nice shot. Oh. You'd be proud of me, Nikki. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like, yeah, like Gungeon, yeah. Gungeon is great, uh. Gungeon's great, yeah. Freezer's a cold place, so thank you, Junior. Gungeon, but it's MMO rating, ooh. Yeah, yeah, pretty much, yeah. Yeah, like, I have been thinking of, like, Gungeon as, like, a parallel for this. Think, like, Gungeon, but FF14 raid bosses. I mean, I'm done. Is it bad that I just imagine a moment, like, that one person you played, I think it was, um, Hotline Miami, and they were getting all hyped up, realizing they were doing guns at Krimbo, and yeah. they, they put on their glasses and go, let's go into overdrive. They walk forward and get shot and killed immediately. F. Yeah. It's got it's got the same mood as that's the cutest fucking thing I've seen in my entire life. <laughs> right, so it goes so coordinates are from top left, okay? So that helps. So that means um Player, Vel, Y, Ryan, and a sequel. One. I'm, I'm eating peanuts, by the way, Chad. Don't worry about me. All right, yeah. Else, player, Vel, Y, plus equal one. L if event scan code equals E S. If event pressed, player, Vel, 
y plus equals one else player vel y minus equals minus equals one elif event scan code equals key a if event press player bell x now i should probably do this in last order so yeah since i'm snacking right now does that make me a purple peanut eater god <laughs> Else i have not thought about that song player, in so long bell X plus equal one and then I didn't remember what those little VHSs were called event. because I remember there was I had a collection of those if event where there was like live sing along things. Player Vel. Oh wait, there was one where they were at not one. kind of, but else it was like a kids like a kids show thing almost. Yeah, Bell. yeah. And X there was one where they one. were at Universal Studios when they like, still had the Jaws mm -hmm. ride. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, with sort of, yeah, Gungeon meets MMO Rage with a bit of risk of rain in there, yeah, I'm still, yeah. With certain legal, lo um, legends as progression system unlocking various heroes, you're planning much of a narrative or something very simple with just you're killing gods go wild, yeah, uh, uh, the more straightforward and simple heroes being cheaper, the more complicated and specialized heroes being more expensive, heroes are part of a crew of multiversal warriors who jump from setting to setting to hunt down abusive gods and kill them, hell yeah. Honestly, yeah. I just... I'm okay with the hero system, just let mm. me customize them. Gungeon mode time already, yeah. Yeah, there will probably be at least a bit of customization. That's sounds so much fun to work with narratively, yeah. Uh, look, like just... look if, if you can give me... If you give me a color slider for hair, that's yeah. good enough for me. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like just... It is going to be hero-based, but like, you can't have like a... Uh, big fighty game without customization mm-hmm mm -hmm. i mean and even some games that aren't like big on fighting but kind of when you need to fight they really throw you into it like uh death road to canada oh that game yeah. is ruthless mm -hmm. yeah and like just i should clarify there's not gonna be like and like just i'm pretty sure like just if we charge for this at all it is going to be a buy once thing because mm -hmm. I'm certainly I certainly don't want microtransactions in. Here's could have yeah. like variants of their abilities or something else. Sorry, narratives of God Slaying are kinda of my whole deal. Yeah, absolutely Artemis. Yeah. Right, so now here's the question. Um Is there like um So Is there like um a so frame function or oh it's um under process okay so idle processing um, and it's kind of honestly let me kind of talk about the whole combo system and whatnot hmm? or when she was telling us about the, the concept um it reminded me of a game that I've wanted to cover on stream for a while, but I haven't found the right time to do so. But it is a game called Resonance of Fate, mm. which is a JRPG with Gun Kata. Ooh. I'm talking John Woo Gun Kata stuff. Nice. And uh, the game's awesome. Maybe, maybe yeah, one day I'll show uh, it. How about because, um, bar actually, hold on. units per second? Five. Ah. Oh. Maybe make it Risk Grand 2 where there are cool alternate abilities to get through achievements, too. Uh. Yep. Yeah. So, well, we're fixating, yeah. Uh. Two melee ideas I have so far is high quality or high mobility cyborg ninja and orku punch is real good, yeah. <clears throat> yeah. How to play to a punch. Yeah. What are you confused? Yeah. Uh, what are you confused about right now, Katten? So. Like this is this is what the weapon customization looks like. Yeah. Yes. Let me, let me go ahead and uh, just 
move this over here. So how about um, there you so go. in This is this is what the weapon customization looks like. Move to uh. close fire. Looks unique. About X yeah. times. So every uh, attachment takes up a different type of slot. Times. And you just uh you just use it in kinda of like an attachy case kinda of RE4 style grid. Delta times units. And it kinda of lets you convert it. Yeah. It's a cool game. Maybe maybe one day I'll uh Funny maybe one day I'll stream it. Local X X and Guns are barbaric and should be abolished. <laughs> Let me use my sword. Funny move. Dollar. I'm sorry. I I, I'm sorry. I forgot. I was. I'm sorry. I forgot. I was talking to the person who hired Arya specifically to shoot people. God. All right. So. Yes. I hire her because she is actually good at it. Yeah. I mean, remember oh. again, my timeline. Guns are not a thing for a reason. We had the little, right. we had like the little, the little companion robots for shooting stuff. Yeah, you got me there. Let's see how you can't, you can't have stuff. good um, homoeroticism with a gun. It's always best done with a sword. Says you, okay? <laughs> you have not, you have not, you clearly have not educated yourself on MGS3 Wait, revolver um, ocelot. Who I should, literally, oh no, is, I am, who literally I am well aware. Is his, in his pants every single time he reloads a revolver. Right. However, what I mean is rush like, of combat. Uh, tilting, like, look, tilting the, tilting your fallen enemy's chin upward to look at you in the eyes with a with a rifle seems. is not the same when it's not a sword. Yeah, it has to be a sword. That's fair. I I I, dis I disagree. I mean, the bayonet can work, but a sword is a sword. A yeah. sword is a sword, but a shotgun is a shotgun. So. Yeah, main dot Right, but okay. you can't you you can't take your time and be slow with a shotgun. Again, I main. will disagree. <laughs> if you if you can prove to me this is a viable thing, then I I will pay attention. Okay, but what, I still what think swords are inherently sexier. What what, it, what incites more what incites more terror? Somebody sharpening, somebody sharpening a dagger, or somebody slowly loading, slowly loading six rounds into a revolver, right, so, um, and taking and taking their time and just being like, okay, this one's for you, this one's for your friend. I'm not talking about intimidation. I'm talking about arousal. Well, although apparently to your hog, they are one and the same sometimes, or so I've been told. I didn't realize that that was the conversation. I thought it was about utility. <laughs> no, no, it was entirely about what's sexier. Swords are sexier. You can take your time right. with a sword. I'm okay. So here's, yeah, still if someone chains on. Okay. Um. All right. Why is writing. nothing appearing? Um. um <laughs> oh. <clears throat> now. Why is nothing, like, appearing here? What? Um... Yeah. <laughs> it's a sword. Current Mickey tank ideas are Sakura, Grant who uses flower magic, and huge knight with shield bigger than he is. Nice. Us dagger is uh, definitely more terrifying than overall. Yeah. Someone with chainsaw and power armor could be a worthwhile melee addition. Yeah. Is the camera enabled? It should be. Um... I don't... I'm too um, laggy. Don't worry about it, Nekoro. Enjoy your time. We're just chilling. Why parry when you can sidestep? You can sidestep. Why, with a why parry what are you when about? you why parry when you can when you can flash step and phase through bullets? Uh, how do you um enable the? <laughs> Literally everything you're saying can be done with a gun. Yeah. Um, oh, I know, yes. I know. Camera but again, yeah. how the how the hell do I enable the camera? I am very lost. I'm incredibly lost here. What the hell? Um, what am I doing? What am I doing? Swords are sexier because the amount of absurd choreography you can do with melee weaponry is far more visually interesting. Yet yeah, set current to enable. Ah, all right. This is true. Truth that, is that, that, sounds like some, that sounds like somebody who hasn't seen a John Woo, uh, John Woo flick. 
Um, John Wick. John, no. No. Oh, John Woo's the director, right? Yeah. Uh, John yeah, Woo is uh, the guy who basically mainstreamed gun kata in the first place. John Wick is methodical, yes. He counts his shots, but there is a degree of absurdity in what he does. Like, him hell yeah. having a suppressed handgun fight while just ah. walking through a crowd of people and nobody notices. Mm -hmm. Well, yes, because the it's gun don't sound like uh, that. Yeah. Gun kata. Oh, uh, Katn is wondering what gun kata is. Uh, would, do we, do any of y'all have like a, like, good on top of your head explanation? Otherwise, uh, I can gun pull it. is, uh, gun kata is- Doing while headshotting people. Yeah. It's basically, it's basically like gun dancing. It's, yeah. if you played, uh, if you played Max Payne, that's a form of gun kata. Mm -hmm. Yeah, oh, like just if you've seen The Matrix, they do a ton of gun kata in that. Yeah, like gun kata um, is all about like shooting as many things as at, um as fast as possible, as stylishly as possible. Yeah, G uh, John Wick is on the same level as like the Bourne trilogy. Devil yeah. May Cry, Dante. Yeah, like just Dante um, is very gun kata. Yeah. Yeah, like just. Yeah, like Dante Bayonetta's gun kata. Yeah, you know, like stuff like that. Yeah, Swords of Sex Yeah. Yeah, you know, like you can definitely do a lot of like fancy choreography either way. I just but, live. I just live in a world where if you if you ran at somebody with a sword, you'd be dead seven ways from Sunday. So. Hmm. Right, so let's... Maybe, maybe it's just maybe it's just a regional difference, and also you don't have guns that are custom made by Arya to be as streamlined and flashy as possible. Oh, I found a glitch. Its overall utility. Oh, uh -huh. that's all right. There's something interesting I've made that just uh lets it zoom off to infinity. Mm-hmm. And beyond. Uh, probably beyond, but I kill it too quick. Mm -hmm. It's like, uh, oh, super hot is a perfect explanation of gun kata. Yeah. yeah. Gun kata is a style that works. I've seen plenty of that stuff, but it's a very limited compared to what can be done with the sword. Yeah. Like, um, the big issue with gun kata is like, it's a bit more difficult to like animate in like a pixel style, which this is probably going to go for. Yeah. 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 Like just, you know, super hot. That is gun kata. Yeah. It, it's, <laughs> it, it's also just on a, it's also just on a personal level that um, I think if you prefer one over the other, there's no changing your mind about it. Yeah, it is. It is virtually impossible to change anyone's mind on their preferred weaponry. If you like melee weapons, you're gonna like melee weapons forever. But I, on the other hand, okay. the, there are so many sword animations that I've seen in my life. I'm so fucking sick of swords. <laughs> Yeah. I think then then you and I have the exact opposite problem then. I've seen so many gun animations and so many so many uh variants of, of guns and it's like swords are cooler though. Yeah. But then again, I'm also someone who appreciates the finesse of ridiculous stuff like Jedi lightsaber. Yeah. But the, the handling but the handling of a sword is so similar across the across the spectrum. And then you like get to certain categories where it changes slightly. Like you know, you're not gonna use a short sword the same way that you would like a bastard yeah. sword or a great mm -hmm. sword or anything of those. Yeah, for me, of... guns are the most boring thing in the world because they're way too real. Yeah, that is like that is a big factor of like the fan, like realism versus fan, like fantasism aspect of like just some folks like it being realistic, some don't. I think that's probably why I like Destiny guns more than real ones, is that because they're completely made up. Sure, they have basis Whoa. on real-world weaponry, but... I mean, how... It, it's it's fun to watch mm. a rocket launcher that's, that has a big ball on the end fire yeah. off tons of micro-missiles and just explode something, and somehow that thing doesn't die. Mm -hmm. So you can do it again, Wait, is it? and again, Oh, and again, oh, I know what's going it on. Dead. Yeah. Oh, it's ah! Fuck you, Windows. Uh, <laughs> always Windows, isn't that? 
Yeah. To, you know, to complete the joke, you should have gone the code net route of just completing it with Windows 7. Like, no, this is all, um... yeah, like, this is an all Windows issue. What's that pixel art from Lama? It is an asset pack I got in an itch bundle a while back. It is not final art. It is not going to end up looking like that. It is just what I've got for now, and I figured out why it's acting weird, and that's because guess what happens on Windows if you hold down a key for a long time? Sticky keys? No, um, it starts rapidly inputting, and that counts it as, like, and it's counting uh, that as mm. a new press. Mm -hmm. Oh. Yeah. I've seen I mean, too many on, real on people the... have guns in my life. They suck and they're brutal and horrible. Yeah, that's fair, Artemis. Uh, although I will say, like, I'm not, I'm not trying to remove any enjoyment you have, Nikki. I just like swords because yeah. they look mm -hmm. neat. Yeah, I, it, it comes from a personal standpoint that, believe it or not, I've been around knives so often because I'm, you know, my my dad in particular is a hunter, mm -hmm. so you know, I've yeah. been around, I've been around the block a few times, you know, very outdoorsy type. Yeah. So legitimately. If you put it, if you put an axe in front of me and told me, yeah, I saw some, I saw some dude doing a spinning helicopter attack, I would be like, that's, I mean, I can, I can do that with a stick, hooray, <laughs> like, weapons are so generalized that if people have issues with guns, in, in that sense of like, oh, they're, you know, they're too real or whatever, or, yeah. they're, not, or they're not, you know, flashy or anything like this. Then, what the fuck are swords? <laughs> well, swords, yeah. swords, swords, and all other sorts of melee weapons and stuff have been around way longer. Well, but they're just, also not as accessible. So I guess yeah, like that's the main thing is that like just a lot, a lot more people are killed. Like a lot more people nowadays know someone who's been killed by a gun than been killed by a sword. That's true, unless you're in Florida. That's kind of the yeah. outlier. <laughs> Florida does, does not count in statistical studies. Yeah, Florida. More people have died to alligators in Florida than, than yeah. guns. The, word, the world's I have in mind so far is sort of uh, the plant people versus fungus people planet, the cyberpunk post apocalypse planet, grim dark Catholic planet, high tech false utopian world where everything is apple tech looking white, and planet where literally everyone is a mage. Those sound fun, but yeah. Florida isn't real. Florida is not real. Okay. It's, it's not real. It's, it's the only thing country. that's real in Florida are the gators. Yeah. They're the only yeah. things that are valid in Florida. So, I think... I mean... Nova, you kind of already said this, but... I think, I think the issue... I think, I think the issue a lot of people have with guns outside of the real-world angle... Mm -hmm. is separating, separating from that, because that's an argument that nobody here, nobody here will dispute. Yeah. Um, new, new planet idea, Florida Gator World. <laughs> um, that exists. It's called Gatorland. Right? Yeah. I uh, I just think that there's more creativity to be had with uh, firearms in terms of their yeah. animation than mm -hmm. swords, because yeah. swords, at least in like first person. At least in first person, yes. Because yeah. in third in third person, like. The, the main issue is that swords, while limited, allow for more flashy stuff, but mm -hmm. gameplay suffers as a result of that of that approach. So, yeah. like, if, if you want to talk about, like, oh, the pinnacle of, you know, flashy sword play or anything of that sort, you know, a lot of people will default to, like, The Witcher or anything like that. But to me, I, I would rather... I would rather play Skyrim over Witcher mm -hmm. 3 because melee combat takes so fucking long. You're spending 90% yeah. of your animation doing flashy shit and only 10% actually hitting people. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like just... It's like, it's a, lot, it's a lot like how you compare, um... Because I often, whenever I think about it, despite that it's meant to be a comedy and absurdist <laughs> in all the best places, Monty Python and the Holy Grail has one of the single most historically accurate of uh, period sword fights, and that's with the Black Knight. Yeah. The yeah. whole segment of leading up to the Black Knight, they use the weight. They show what it's like to use a sword of that mm -hmm. size, how yeah. slow it would be to swing, how heavy it can hit, 
what it's yeah, no, actually they were, meant to do. Yeah, no, Monty Python was com it was always completely dedicated to the bit. Yeah. Our default is mm -hmm. Dishonored and, and 2 for swordplay, yeah. Stuff. And I yeah. swear to God, I if anybody brings up Lord of the Rings... Yeah. I still need to yeah. play Dishonored 2. I've heard a lot of good things about it. I just have never gotten around to it. I and, I, and, I, and, I, well. and I swear to God, if anybody brings up Lord of the Rings as showing good swordplay, what swordplay? Yeah. There's like, there's like maybe a total of like four four scenes in the whole in the whole trilogy that actually have sword fights that don't just cut immediately to someone else cutting someone in half, which immediately cuts to Legolas shooting like twenty people with a bow, like. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Lord of the Rings doesn't revel in its violence, which is an approach that I can appreciate as, you know, a filmmaker of sorts. But if you're going to spend so much time building up to a fight scene, then you should at least revel in it a little bit. You should at okay. least show that these people are skilled with their weapons and stuff. <laughs> and not yes, do and not do what they walk. did, which is immediately kill a dude. Which is like immediately kill a dude who barely even really showed his own prowess. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. right, now in the first, like so, God, I I hate Lord of the Rings. Alright, so Yay, I've got uh movement. Like very basic like character movement. Biggest issue with the Black Knight is having a sword um like that to actual cutting against an armored foe, yeah. Well, that's because they weren't meant to cut. See, mm -hmm. people think that swords like that were meant to cut. They're not. The reason why they're so massive is because it was meant to bash through the armor, not yeah. cut yeah. through it, bash through it. Yeah. That's why you have weapons called the Mail Breaker, because that was what it was intending to do. Mm -hmm. it, was in t it was attempting to break through the mail yeah. and the chain mail underneath. Mm -hmm. Yeah. People but, also think knights were big and slow. They weren't. No, they were very agile. Right, so they were very see... agile, very fast. Okay, There's so... a video of a man in uh, very, of like, you know, common knight armor versus a fully equipped uh, modern soldier doing a whole obstacle course. The knight wins. Yeah. Like a solid, like, five seconds, I believe. Yeah. No, the. That's also kind of. That's also kind of the problem with knights in the first place too though is that they wear all this bulky through, fucking armor yeah. and it does nothing <laughs> yeah like, actually the moment yeah. that you're hit by something big that is designed to <laughs> fuck you up yeah, no, you are down you know alicia brought up swords were sidearms usually hammers were most often used for breaking through plate yeah. mail yeah yeah mm -hmm. or, or, or hammers and war axes and yeah such. And, okay and malls, so yeah. now that i've got all right so i've done mm -hmm. something that I've never so like I've got a character moving around that's that makes me really happy because I haven't ever really gotten that far before yeah mm. uh, so. I mean on the the other thing about not even just melee weapons in general and stuff is I is kind of Actually. the counterpoint to my own argument but also sort of sets its own point which is uh, there are more realistic yeah. depictions of melee weapons uh, than is probably like led on to believe. Like in, in my head, I think Chivalry oh. Two is more realistic of the setting than Arma. Mm -hmm. You know, because Arma takes in all these factors and all this other stuff. But sh Chivalry fair, I don't too, think it's possible to load some C4 under a tank and launch it onto a building, but... Right, so... No, it is! I'm not talking so... Battlefield. Battlefield is a different beast entirely. <laughs> well, I, I've seen people do that in Arma 3, so... Yeah. Yeah. Alright, so I've got... So, like, I've got, like, normal, um, like, basic up-down-left-right movement. Now I need to figure out other stuff I want to do, like dashes or whatever. And I also might want to look into, like, the physics stuff? So, physics intro, yeah. Yeah, so, collision wow. stuff. If, if I'm also being honest, I think... I think melee weapons are more brutal simply because of the time period. Mm -hmm. Oh, definitely. Uh, 
because back then there wasn't really medicine. Like, if you got... If you got your arm taken off or whatever, you had, like, maybe a 2% chance that you didn't die of sepsis. Specialists uh -huh. are 3D so, healthcare, so... You know. <clears throat> they're, like... Um... There's also a reason why Tri-Edge knives are illegal and everywhere. Yeah. Yeah, because they, they don't allow... They that literally cannot heal. Yeah. So... How do... How the My fuck do I do physics, actually? Leave me alone. Um, I'm not judging you for your knight armor. That wasn't the point. Yeah, um, so time for me to figure you, you out can, how you can physics a, work. Um, you can be you can be in a lovely piece. Of, you can be in a lovely set of armor all you want, Ziona. Yeah. So I think like uh yeah, uh, time for me to learn about physics engine. So woo ah. physics. I left off in Bunny Town. Okay, so Richard Body 2D, okay? So add child to node. Uh, I'm still node trying to push the stream character to Endbringer, Endwalker. Uh, yeah, I still need to. Yeah, I should play some more FF14 soon, probably. That man. I. I. Greatwood. Ow! What yeah. happened? What? Someone sniped you? No, I think something fell on me. Oh no. Did you what get happened? hit by a, did you get hit by a cabal dropship? There wasn't a cabal there's no cabal on the moon. So <laughs> well, now there are on me. <laughs> I hear dust giants. Oh no, stop it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh collision shape. Um Cabal stomp. I still very much want a single player port of Destiny 1. We'll, we'll have that when we'll have that when Bungie's done with their uh, in-game lore. How about with a... none of the content removed, I want to be able to play through the entire story of that game. Everything from launch day Crota to uh, that's, to the um, end of the last expansion I ever got to play. I think that was Rise of Iron. Yeah. That was the last expansion of D1 anyways, so. Mm -hmm. Well, yeah, they. I, I never got to play it because that was after they Name. cut support to legacy consoles. Mm -hmm. I, had play, I had played on, a, on an Xbox 360. So, it yeah. was a hand-me-down, so. Yeah. Rectangle shape. Um. I mean, I, uh... Not a lot of people will say this, but I can because it's genuinely like a part of my childhood that this comes from. But I have faith in Bungie as a developer that I I understand what they're doing. You know, I understand that what they're doing is lore based, and when they're done telling this narrative, they will eventually go, "Okay, let's give them everything they wanted." And you know, they'll just give us a full, a full like uninterrupted version of D two with with all the content do, that they added across child. the years and clean it up and stuff because that's what they did in D one. But then, size changes will be overrided by the physical and size. And when uh, when Destiny when Destiny one development was done, they basically put an update in there that if you just did your weeklies you would get a box of cosmetics and if you didn't like what you got in the box of cosmetics you would dismantle them and get a token you got enough tokens and you could buy <sighs> literally yeah, anything I'm magical. Yeah. from the eververse shop yeah. for free Ooh, yeah. oh hello panda great to see ya yeah celtic world is just making me think of smt um for a dog yeah let me scroll back oh, and check sorry i've been yeah, I have been very busy, like, trying to figure out how these physics work and trying to pay attention to, like, the, uh, co conversation in the background, yeah. Lurking at the moment? Yeah, lurk well, Junyu. Yeah, anyway, god hunting, yeah. Uh, so I assume what? Um, assume what is a god varies widely from universe to universe? Yeah, yeah. From super AI, um, to what a master giant fairies, something more akin to the Abraham god, yeah. 
I think it's my very unused pirate world for this. That world's gods are weird when you could literally fight the sun. Ooh. Yeah. It'd also be great to have a world with Celtic Spider Static where the gods in question are uh, um, central and ceiling fair. Yeah. DPS would be a melee pirate swashbuckler where buckler where else. You can absolutely tell me to stop giving suggestions. Yeah. Oh, by the way, um, yeah, no, Artemis, feel free to keep doing, like, as many suggestions as you want. I will not be able to pick up on all of them. Alicia can maybe write them down as while I figure out what the hell I'm doing here. Like, just... Ah. Uh. So, like, if I do this, is this gonna be... Crash! we? Oh. oh, yeah, because Bunny is... Uh... Not, uh, yeah, um, yeah, I need to figure out, I don't, I am very confused about what I'm actually doing here. Ah. Uh. This gun has absurd range. I like this, actually. Although I guess it is just a, a wire rifle. Yeah, uh. So, what am I doing? So, um, area 2D. Ah, alright, so area is, yep. So the area would actually, instead of, yeah, um, you would be, um, arena, probably, then, funny, then arena, let's add a child node of, Position shape 2D, okay. Uh, rectangle shape 2D. Then, like, uh... So main, what are your your actual like? What, um, camera two D. What are your like? How do I like? Um, is that in project settings? Yeah. Ah. Uh, yeah. In 4 Ikes mode, I'm so fucking tired of gods and demons manipulating humanity, so I'm gonna resurrect this random kid in order to kill every single god and demon in the universe, and also restart the universe to turn humans into op- um, yeah, into omnipotent beings. Interesting, yeah. Dog does more of a- That's the Monster Hunter. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? Yeah. The monster population- the monster population is way too high, so we hired a bunch of people to, to slay these monsters if they're if they're vastly overpopulated, but we'll kill them if they kill ah. monsters that aren't on our docket. That's okay. the Monster Hunter lore. It wasn't overpopulation. It was just making sure that th that things remain balanced, not simply through overpopulation. I thought it it's still population control at its at a point. Yeah, it's then. the same as it, it's the same as real hunting. Mm. Real hunting Actually, is typically for population control. Truth be told, the only beef lore monster hunter that I can recall are the bits about Fatalis and why the canonical reason why only four people are allowed yeah, in the party. Yeah, I, I know that one. Yeah. Wait, so how about I stop and is this gonna be happy? Um, no, not in the slightest because I forgot to actually um arena. I know that there was that monster called Mysios who was implied to have the very first Dragonator impaled in its body still. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. In the Anarchy ending, you do just that and... Okay, um... Oh, god, this has gravity now. Oh, no. Ah, I don't want... No gravity. Go away, Isaac Newton. Uh... <laughs> 
Go away, Isaac Newton. We don't need your apples around here. <laughs> and, um, why are you so... What, what if, uh... What if history just took a very, like, weird turn at that point, and... And Isaac Newton thought that only apples, uh, had gravity. Which would right, imply um, that, what, like, when we stop acknowledging it, that's when we can suddenly fly and defy it. Yeah. I like this implication, let's go with that. No, I'm just yeah. gonna... Uh... It's basically, that's basically Neverland. We're, we're, we're basically going to, into, ah, like, Peter Pan right. storytelling um... at this point. Which I'm fine with. I'll be, I'll be Sora. Why not? Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll have. Fly, I'll, yeah. I'll fly around and in do the what anarchy you do. ending. You just do that. In the peace ending, you sort of make a new Dagda that isn't genocidal and kill the old Dagda, and then power friendship and collectivism your way through, killing Yo and sort of turning Japan into a commune. Nice. All right, so I am. I haven't been here. I'm going to go to bed. That's fine, Jasper. Don't worry about yeah. it. Yeah, yeah. Get you're rest, Jasper. To, you're not yeah. obligated to join stream. All right, so I am just completely lost in everything I'm doing right now. Like, just, <laughs> Jesus Christ. I have no idea what's going on, what I'm supposed to be doing. I've, uh, I have no idea how, like, the physics actually work or anything. But I do need collision to- sounds like a game dev. Uh, the actually, game do we? Life. Yeah, uh. Probably, yeah. So. I don't know what's going on, uh, but it's working, so I don't care. <laughs> so, let's start, so main, I'm going to just start off, so like, uh, we're going to make an area 2D, create, no gravity, okay, alright, area 2D, you are going to be, um, thank you for the hydrate, Jasper. Oh, that's right. Crossplay is a thing for this game now, isn't it? Yeah. Thank God. In which game? It's amazing. It took so long. Uh, for Destiny 2. They, ah. They, uh, apparently that's been, so been spinning the works for a very long time, but they hmm. either they couldn't get it done or they didn't have the time to get it done. I see. So yeah. we all um, just got it. I forget well, what it was, but... Well, A, it's... A, it's easily because of the blizzard oh. exclusivity and b mm. uh crossplay is a surprisingly difficult thing to implement in anything because oh, you yes, have to be, you have to you have to basically develop yeah. the game with that infrastructure in mind and if it isn't developed with that infrastructure in mind then you have to you have to add that infrastructure into every version mm -hmm. and that time's <laughs> And that can be, and that, and that can get messy. Okay, yeah, there. the worst yeah. thing that can happen in cross class, class will be one of three things. Yeah. Oh, thank you for the hydrate. <laughs> you, could you imagine that sound that played earlier that you had that wonderfully yeah, uh, clip-worthy commentary for? The five for the it came from a motorcycle like, like this. Or if Gentry oh, could be very interesting. Well. Yeah. Imagine this, given there's going to be a blast class. class? Yeah. <laughs> okay, so. All right, I have the got. The last thing you see before you're a victim of hit and run. Alright, so area 2D. No gravity, I'm got it, yeah. It's not just a gun on its own, to be honest. There is a gun that has a lion's face like that, I think. I think I have it. Alright, so area 2D. Alright, what? Alright, so now I've it's got an area light. 2D. Yeah, it's a kinetic grenade launcher. What the? You know, I'm actually gonna just, um. I'm just gonna go to the project manager and open up because there's, like, this, yeah. Alright. Now Let me take a look at I this one. The um, so like, here's like, yeah. So, seen interesting. Okay, so we've got like a static, which is, um, oh, you're a static body 2D. Okay, so we don't need an area 2D. It looks okay. You're all, yeah, a, yeah. Ball T scene is just a sprite and collision. Okay. So yeah. All right. So you're just a collision box. All right. Polygon 2D, yeah. Uh... Oh, alright. Yeah, so I just need, like, a static body 2D, okay. And then... And yeah, then it's got collision, yeah. Okay, yeah. Got it, so... 
just um, a static body to that then. All too seen is just a sprite in collision. Okay, yeah. Project, quit the project list. Yep. I'll just show you who does whatever Magic Fair would use. <laughs> Oh, and here's that rocket launcher I mentioned earlier. Alright, so... Oh, what, the word clip coil? Yes. Oh yeah, word clip coil was my done. first exotic, so, and it's great. So, um, we're gonna make a... You should Ever show, since... um, you should show the hive. The colony? Yeah, the colony. I do have that one. The colony is really cool. Alright, so... Insectoid robot grenades. Yeah, it's, mm. it's, it's an insectoid nanite grenade launcher. Looks good. Back body tube D, okay, yeah, so. They chase the target. Yeah. And then there's exactly. also. There, there's also. I don't know. Let me think about what. Yeah. I don't know. Jude, is there anything that you think would be interesting in terms of design? In what, like, aspect of design? I, I guess just anything aesthetically that you think would be cool to see. Hmm. Because there are a lot of really cool-looking exotic weapons in the That's, game, yeah, but um, there's a style for everyone. Uh, Ridge. I kind of like gothic style, to be honest. Gothic? Okay. You know what? That is actually a thing. Gothic style is actually a thing in uh, in Destiny 2 exotics. Um, I'm thinking... Does bad juju count? <laughs> bad juju definitely counts. Rat King definitely counts. Wait, so... Wish Ender, I'd say, counts. Royal Rat Authority. Um... Eight by eight. Yeah. Right then... Thorn. Um... Make another... Oh, that, yes. Bridge body Crim Crimson is definitely a gothic one. Honey... Oh, I have Crimson. It's my yeah, favorite Yeah, Crim Crim Crimson's, uh, Crimson's gothic punk, for sure. Add child node, um... <clears throat> position shape 2D... And make a new rectangle shape... They, um, um, I mean, anything that's taken is also pretty good for a gothic style, like Whisper of the Worm. I like the added blood splatter on that for no real reason. Oh, it, it's because it's a it's because it's a weapon of um, it's because it's a weapon of sorrow. It actually drains the life uh, out of uh, it drains the life out of anyone. Shape it kills. Yeah. Hmm. According to a visual vanguard Rectangle policy, shape, this yeah, there then. Exist. Yeah. And I can there. There's also this ridiculous weapon. Now here's the I question: like Will it, this work? Um, maybe the dark fairy could be. Ah, right. Um, I forgot. Uh, it's like someone trying to make a Gatling gun into an actually usable format. Oh, are you talking about sweet business? Stop it! Yes. No, no, sweet no, 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 no. Uh, Why? You you... Grab me again. Yeah. This is a personal favorite, though. I don't want gravity. This is a hmm. top-down game. I just want collision detection. And they're still overlapping it's because I... Yeah, uh, potential sort of controller caster who does debuffs and makes enemies temperature and on their allies. Yeah. yeah, maybe the Dark Fairy could be a sort summoner caster who makes corrupted animals do weird shit. Yeah. We should never game company Hellbot Games or something. <laughs> yeah. I might... I mean, I definitely have been, like, thinking about... Uh, yeah, like the yeah, like just I've got like a somewhat like I've got like a placeholder name for like just the projects like the kind quasi studio I've been like making projects under the banner of, but like it's very like me oriented, and I don't want that, and I want to like think up a different name for it. Okay, so mm -hmm. now that I've got these, okay, um, now that they actually have like. Collisions. Um. I guess, honestly, that's a game that I've wanted to stream for a while because it's been on my list for such a long time. I was, I was just thinking about it in terms of the, um, in terms of what uh, you're making, Mama. Yeah. Um, I was thinking about Crawl. Hmm. Uh, Crawl is an asymmetric multiplayer RPG. Or not an asymmetric, I mean an oh. asymmetrical <laughs> multiplayer RPG. What um, is this? 
it is uh yeah basically one player is the he one player is the um hero quote unquote and they go through a dungeon and clear all the rooms in order to beat a final boss at the end and the other three players are spirits that haunt the dungeon and can control monsters and traps in the dungeon to try to kill the player to gain control of their body and be the hero yeah i it's am like a power wheels version of a sparrow that sounds about right. I kind of, I kind of want this. You mean a Hot Wheels? No, a Power Wheels. Okay. It was the like, the, like the, the child's equivalent of the, the, the rideable cars. Yeah, yeah. What the yeah. hell am I doing? That's a good question. I don't yeah. know. I've been story writing for the past two hours. You know, I'm like just... <laughs> oh god, it is already eight. Jesus, okay. Yep. Um. Yep. Yeah, I'm just trying to figure out like... What the... It's a just, um, oh, it's because. Ooh. Um. A PVC sparrow, my favorite. <laughs> How about. Uh, you ride on it and you become a, a, an SD version of yourself. Now. How do I. Like, uh. Yeah, I'm. Ah. Uh, how does this, like, how do you, like, oh. check? This is, like, I don't. <sighs> how do I, like, tell the physics engine to move something? Okay, yeah, like, just. What am I even doing? Um. So, oh, contact reporting. Okay. Where are these enemies? Like, oh, not keep a contact. Okay, yeah. Um. Oh, it. Ah, oh, move and collide. Okay. Um. So, move and collide. The reason why I say this gun is very me code is because it has the ability to open up a small portal after enough precision hits. Oh, is that a fire oh, it's on kinematic body? Okay. Alternate timeline version of the gun. Hmm. Kinematic and body, being okay. A timeline hopper, well. Oh no! I timed that jump very poorly. Um. That is. Ah, it isn't. Uh, there. Now is that gonna do something? It's... Ah, no it's not! Um... What does Move and Clyde want? Um... Oh, uh... Vector 2. collide. Ha-ha! Fuck yeah! Woo. I've got collision, I've got collision. I'm probably actually not gonna use that too much except for except for the background. So yeah, uh, hooray! Collision works. Now I can make it so you only collide with, like, the stuff you wanna. Alright, so... Project settings, um... I remember this room. <laughs> Comment. All right, so. I like what you've done with the place. The red drapery really has it come together. Uh, 
Um, so I'm gonna say layer one is, um, uh, then entities, then AOEs, um, entities, AOEs, uh, projectiles, and environment. Alright, now I can make it so... Right there. Ooh, Haunted House. Hello, Sella. How are you? Welcome to party, Sella. Now I can, um... I know, uh, you want to stick on entities, yeah. Ask with environment, yeah? Yeah. Right, now I'm going to make a, let's say... I'm gonna make a new one, which is what I actually want. So, Polygon 2D. Ah, uh, well, your audio processor's way ahead of your emotional level, like almost a full three seconds ahead, huh? Um, All really? Right. It looks like it's just fine on OBS's side. It might just be like uh. auditor. Yeah. Uh, it might just be like mismatch. I'm not sure. Like. Unless OBS is doing something really wrong. Might just been a hiccup. Hopefully, yeah. Hope it was just a hiccup, yeah. Let's draw. Hey Nikki, do you remember this location? I can uh, hear the roaring in my head. You're muting or muted, Nikki. I probably tapped out at some point. Ah. <laughs> Now I can um, duplicate yeah. and change. Well, thank you for telling me. I didn't actually know. And then um, a... I was I was saying before. Um... The roaring is very and prominent in my head. I can hear it. I uh, I said before that um it was. I actually forgot what I was going to say, because I actually forgot the conversation again. Uh. <laughs> um, oh, right, chat. Chat delay. Um, I saw it on Jasper's stream recently. So it does. it's not like an isolated incident. Yeah. Uh, bad, like, really bad chat delay, or...? Um, there, like, yeah, it... The message would show up on Jasper's stream before it showed up in the chat. Oh, uh, yeah. It was, it was very weird. Oh, inverse delay. Yeah. It might have to do with it might have to do with Twitch's API. Yeah, it might be just their IRC server being weird, yeah. Right. Yeah. It's okay now. So yeah, now if I check, you can walk through that good, and now you can't walk through that. Neat. Yay! I stream to you from the future. Mm hmm Yeah. This is what I do, so I mean. You can still go off the edge there, but yeah. Alright, yay, I've got collision stuff set up. And now, Ooh. I can do fancier things with that. So, let's say there's like, um... Bar, can, um, can, dash, equals, true. Lowercase roof in this, okay. And LF event scan code equals E. <laughs> if event rest can dash is false. Uh -huh. <laughs> the location Pardon. that I've entered. Whenever I come to the moon, I always come to this spot because it was one of the most terrifying. Dash, D1. Equals, oh yeah, uh, you're at the 
Fun you're lot. at the, 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 strock, the, yeah, the strike bridge Dash that time. screams at you. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Dash time equals... Wait, five. Else. I like hearing yeah. monstrous roars long before you see what's causing it. And dash yeah. equals false. It's called, else. Foresh yeah. it's called foreshadowing, and it's important for a good uh, dramatic dash. beat. Yeah. I also just love this spot, because this is the internal part of the moon. What is that light going to? Hmm. Um, I think it actually goes to the center of the moon. Yeah, uh, ooh! Glacier with Team Pwop, thank you! Because cause remember, uh, Crota's lair... Crota's lair is in the center of the moon. I never saw Crota's lair. Uh, yeah, Crota's lair is in the center of the moon, and uh, it at Crota's throne, there's this giant ball of, like, gr palish green energy mm -hmm. called, uh, that's the Oversoul. Yeah, then... Oversoul sounds like isn't that if the name of a video game? Time. No, that's Overwatch. Like <laughs> well, no, I thought I, I I swear I've seen something called Oversoul before. You know what? I'll Google so, it. How about actually? Um, it is a free online PvP turn-based combat battle card MMO game that plays right inside your browser. Mm. I don't think that's what you thought, <laughs> but there is a game called it. It was not. Alright. Oh. I'm Vector glad to have helped. Two X movement. Why move? Oh no, I'm thinking of the game mechanic. Yeah. There was a mechanic in a video game, and I, I forget what it was, but the mechanic was oversold, and if you activated it, it was like a temporary buff or something? Mm-hmm. Well, in uh, Destiny, the oversold is a wipe mechanic, so... Oh, fun. It's, it's honestly not that hard. If you don't die, the Oversoul doesn't spawn. And if the Oversoul does spawn, then you just shoot it. Dash. I'm if you shoot it, it disables the Oversoul. Yeah. Uh, dash. I you can't, you can't, you can't stab out. an Oversoul now, can you? Else. Dash. I mean, oh. I stabbed the soul once or twice. Uh, it depends on what you and... get soul. Look, I'll, I'll, I'll take I'll take back my statement True. on melee weapons in one way, and the only way is because yes. Oversoul is of, FF10 uh, too. Ah, uh... ooh, whoops! Thank you, Alicia. The, um, All right. The only thing I'll take it back on is uh, a, a, is uh, Asura's wrath with the uh, the one boss fight uh, that has this uh, samurai right. with the like it like the. Ah. Uh, forever extending sword that stabs you, stabs you through Earth and back onto the moon. Um, Godovic. What if your sword had an avatar that spoke to you? Back to um, map. Okay, so what am I doing that's wrong here? Skyward Sword. I I, I, I fucked up somehow. Um. Oh, I Master, can just I'm here to tell um. You your batteries are low. If there if there's an avatar inside the sword, that typically means that the sword is evil. It is going to try to corrupt you, based on my D and D. Based on my D and D knowledge. Oh, it's funny because I, I was, weapons are never good. I was half expecting the the argument of saying, okay, but what if your gun could literally turn into your girlfriend, and that's just soul eater. Yeah. Ooh, yo, <laughs> y'all, yo. Oh, yes, two of them. Y'all. And he's not interested in either of them. <laughs> Hello. Yeah? Check out what I just did. I've got dashing in the game now. Great. Nice. And of course you'd want to do like animations and such here. Now we can oh, uh, did you by chance read the paragraph I sent? Um, I have not had time yet. I've been hyper fixating. That's valid. <laughs> yeah, let me... Yeah. Hello, hello, MCP123. Great to see ya. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh. <gasps> Exotic Distrop, I got the Huckleberry. Hey. Yeah, you had a headache? Is a good what happened? Second. She asked. Mm. Faye leaned back into her chair, not breaking eye contact. As doubtful as I was, I avoided telling them about the file corruption in my attempts to repair the data. 
I vividly detailed everything about what I had gone through last night. The sense of familiarity of seeing a beautiful lake and the dread of that familiarity, like a part of me needed to avoid it. Then came the words I spoke, how I said them subconsciously, and how the thought of depending on such a thing made me ill as if I had experienced it before. Yet, the memory wasn't there, only the remnants of what I assume was a random bit of self-awareness in an attempt to blend in. That's really fucking good. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, uh... I am... Yeah. Me too. Yeah, uh, I am very happy with that little, like, dash movement. Oh, I know- I see- I know something I should do. My teacher stabbed me once and that gave uh, me super sword powers with the ability to nuke a planet? Live Chapter L one. X O R Live Vel Y equals O or, Actually, no, I'm gonna have like a- Um <laughs> Can I start a new gonna... trend? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Can I start a new trend sure. of renaming um, anime from 10 plus years ago what they would be as an isekai title? Hmm. By all means. So yeah. like, so like for Bleach, I could say uh, a ghost girl invaded my room and then stabbed me, and suddenly I'm a, I'm a, <laughs> and now I have ghost powers and an oversized sword! Exclamation mark! Question mark. Mm hmm. Chapter yeah. one of yeah. five thousand. <laughs> Every new arc of Bleach has a completely different title that sounds like it has nothing to do with the one that came before it. Why are you angry? Because it doesn't. Uh, oh yeah, because oh. those have to be input. Oh, yeah. Barrier night. <laughs> what a joke. I stole, I stole, I stole a random girl's bicycle, and now I'm the number one. And now I'm the number one person in my league. What? Pokemon oh. Isekai. Because oh. <laughs> God. He wishes. He wishes. He did win. He did win one. He did. He win did a finally league. win. Yeah. Yeah. He After did what? Twenty plus years. Hey, let's be honest. We 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 all kind of get it. We all kind of get working our absolute hardest and only succeeding after 20 years, all right? Yeah. That's, you know what, valid. That I will I will accept that only because same. Yeah. <laughs> and I guess we're still kind of waiting on the Galar stuff to see if he'll actually win that, so. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Our... But I will be honest, though, I, I kind I of think... like that he did not actually win most of the stuff he did the first time. Mm -hmm. he, he got he far, far, but he, he, he did not win. City. And you know what? Honestly, that's how life is sometimes. You might not win, but you did your best, and everyone's proud of you for it. Yeah. Yeah. And, and, uh, and Pokemon also had the moral of it's not about the... Five. It's not about the end of the road, but the path you make on the journey. Yeah. The real, the real league champions are the friends we made along the way. Yeah. Except that's actually applicable. Except for yeah. Tobias, because he was a jerk with a Darkrai and a Latias at the league. Yeah. That's oh true. god, don't remind me so... of that. That was... No, the sad part is, it's like, that's just every player who's played Pokemon. <laughs> Honestly, the, the, the thing about Tobias also, also hits me weird, because I, I think about the, um... I think mm -hmm. about Pokemon Heroes, and I'm just, just like, he goes into the Pokemon League and walks in there, and then Tobias pulls out a Latias, and Ash is just like, is that the girl that, is that the, is that the girl <laughs> God, that kissed yeah. me, or is that just- I'm yeah. a boy, but also a girl, and now I have to marry my panda father's best friend's daughter. Yeah, mm. Rama one half. Oh, that's Rama. Yeah. Nice. Good pull. Um, so, uh, can, I, can, I pull, can I pull an anime name to see if any of you know what it is? Uh, sure. Have any of you heard of Kashi Mashi? Yeah, I know Kashimashi. No. I don't. Of course but I do. But that's because yeah. I don't watch a lot of anime. Our live 
Yeah. So it's an it's an older one, but it was basically I think it was just called I think the translation for it was boy boy meets girl or girl meets girl or something like that. Um. Yeah. And yeah. The, the premise was that the the main character who was a boy gets turned into a girl. I think indefinitely, and they just live out their life as a girl from that point on. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it was kind of transcoded, but I don't remember anything else about it. Yeah. I just know that it was a thing that existed. I, I know that I really should watch the English dub of Bo 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 Yeah, Bo 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 It's Kashimashi Girl Meets Girl, yeah. Yeah. I actually unironically want to watch that anime, Bo Bo Bo. Super powered nose hairs. With a big muscle afro Now, this should, if I. If only because I. If only because I like absurdist anime, but I also don't want to watch, mm -hmm. like, uh, Gintama. <laughs> Gintama right. is, like, a commitment. Yeah. <clears throat> yes, right, it so... is, but I think they also did that for the joke as well, because yeah. now that I think about it, they Thank parry you, everything. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so update on what's going on on my side. I have now got it to a point where the, um, yeah, so now it's now at a point where um when you're dashing you can't like change direction in the middle of the dash so you've got to like commit to it okay which is oh, oh, yeah and you also was, like kind of like once had it described to me gintama was described to me as this is the monty python of anime and i heard that and after looking it up, I am hard pressed to say that is more or less true. Yeah, basically true. Yeah, I am very happy that I've got like just this. So now, yeah, thinking dashes are definitely going to be the thing melee characters do mostly. Yeah, I'm mostly just implementing like the general movement physics. These won't be enabled for every, yeah, for every class, of course. But yeah, over here, really. Yeah, like just. Yay, I've got, like, movement physics. And now, because I've... And, like, you can... Now I can, like, set iframes and everything. Ah, uh, 810, okay, yeah. I was bullied in school for my entire life, but then I found out the reason was because I had a fox demon inside me. God. Inuyasha? <laughs> Naruto. 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 Uh, <laughs> I'm not good at anime, like I said. <laughs> yeah, one, as soon as you said fox demon, it's like, yeah, it's Naruto. Alright, okay. so now I'm gonna... My grandpa, who was Indiana Jones once, brought me home a puzzle, and now I have a gay pharaoh inside my body. Uh, Stardust Crusaders? Yu-Gi-Oh. Yeah. 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 All right, so, uh... Well, dual, Yu-Gi-Oh dual monsters, specifically. Yeah, general. The original Mom. and best Yu-Gi-Oh. Okay. I would say the only good Yu-Gi-Oh, but five Ds exists. Is there a way to, like, make, like... I have plus the logistics of figuring out card games on motorcycles. Hmm. They actually yeah, handle that different kinds of dash on they, different they heroes. Mean, but... Yeah. So like I one dash does a... this, one dash that can be changed in direction of a dash character with like three little dashes. Yeah. I, I don't know if I did these so most. I can help people and now I'm killing gods. All right. So I don't know if I did these Tra most recent blocks. So. <laughs> okay. So. All right. Now that I've got like yeah. So like just. I'm doing like basic generic movement and then these can be customized like per hero or whatever. I need to figure out how the fuck I'm gonna do AoEs. That is gonna be the hard one. Like just the main, like just, ah. Uh, if I can like draw it, then like just, if I can figure out how to draw it, then it shouldn't be a problem. Just well, here's AoE an idea. plug how about you figure out. out how to, um, how about you figure it's out just, how to draw light? Mm -hmm. Yeah, like, just, you know, like, I can, like, just, I know how to, like, do the AoE on, like, the, like, code side. I just need to figure out how to make it, uh, like, do the AoE, like, on the, like, visual side. Like, the warning before it shows up. Yeah, exactly. That's part, that's probably gonna have to be part of the animation. Yeah, like, just, um, 
Like, I'm trying to figure out the best way to make that animation. Uh. Um, we'll start with a, we'll start with a circle. Mm -hmm. Or a square, or whatever your AOE is going to be. Yeah, like, just, and then I'm trying make, to... And then you can make it blink, yeah, like, or you can kind of smileize it. Yeah, no, like, just, I know that, like, just, the issue, like, just, you're not, like, the point I'm running into is, uh, do I have to make a texture for the circle, or is there just some, like, polygon shape I, thing I can I use for it yeah I, I instead of instead of actually making the sprite you're wondering if there is a a way to like draw. yeah basically to keep like okay. the proper pixel density yeah okay that's that's fair there, there should be a way to just draw stroke if it's um um possibly if it's based on if it's based on any semblance of like html or css it's not at all it's its own programming language right yeah, no, this is all, like, just, this is native code, not, um, not interpreted like HTML, CSS, JavaScript. Yeah, so, th so regardless of that pack, there should be a way to draw a stroke. Um, you can draw a line, but, uh... But, yeah, like, is just, there's no reason. Is it possible to make yeah. a, is it possible to draw a uh, line as a radial? You are kind of talking over me. Yeah. I'm trying yeah, to help. Sorry. Yeah, like just I think the main thing is like there's no way like you can um there's no way to like mathematically like draw something. You can like create an arbitrary polygon, you can create an arbitrary line, but you can't make like just a hey, make this a circle no matter what or whatever, as far as I know. You can manually draw and code, otherwise you need a sprite. Yep. Uh Yeah, honestly I think well, just I think a sprite would yeah, like I think a sprite would theoretically be better, so like just let me just make a, like, say, um... Do you have any control over, um, how many sides you can have on a polygon? Um, you can have infinite sides, but, um, th I would still have to, like, draw that out manually. Hmm. Because I was going to say just yeah. do, like, a 360-side polygon. Yeah. Oh. Kind of a messy way to do it, but... Yeah. I have an idea, so... <laughs> A cat space pirate. Her princess rival. A cat? Yes, a cat, space pirate, and her princess rival give me a magic lightsaber and suddenly I'm the savior of space. Tenchi Moyo. I don't think I've ever heard of that one, actually. Tenchi Moyo is ancient. It's like an 80s anime, I think. It's very old. It aired on Toonami a long time ago, but uh. I don't remember anything about it except for... Cat-themed space pirate also has a pet who is also her spaceship. Mm. It's very, it's kind of surreal in a way. Yeah, sounds it. All right, so here's what I'm gonna do. Yeah, all right. Oh. Tension mode is amazing and terrible. Yeah. Oh, thank you for the docs. No. Yeah. So because I can't do this, but I also yeah. For now, I'm going to like uh, let me create a oh. new um. Rigid body. Uh, yeah. All right, so rigid body two D. Stand up for a sec, so I'll be right back. Yep. Uh, add child node sprite. Uh, you're just gonna be texture load AOE dot PNG. Transform is gonna be a. Uh, um, I have right, one. Um, I have one Nova. Mm -hmm. uh, filter uh, off. I'm, I'm addicted to herbs, but my friends appreciate me anyways, which is why I scammed them to work for me. God. <laughs> That's WarioWare. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> Wait. Oh. That's interesting. Okay, that's interesting. Um. Oh, oh no. <laughs> um. Uh, add that might have even gone in a hole. Oh, come on. Uh, uh, circle shape too. This is ski ball but bad.
At least that one went in somewhere. Alright, so there. Now I've got like an AoE. You know what? Um, what scale are you sprites at right now? Um, oh, they're at 4x. That's why it's weird because I'm at the. Well, Harris, and... to be perfectly fair, I was going around killing them for literally no reason whatsoever. 96, mm -hmm. okay. Alright, so now I've got an yeah, now I've got an AoE collision where part of the um AoE's layer, yeah. Okay, so now I've got like the AoE um and I just drag the Ow! Oh. Is it... That's an interesting uh, aesthetic for a shotgun. Yeah. Like a very old hand harem anime, yeah. Um, they're like... Alright, so... Yeah, um... One of five, six, five, two. And then what's the other? Um, negative fifty six, okay. Okay, yeah, so. Wait, um, I know what I want. I know what. Oh, I'm doing something wrong here. Um, then. Oh, uh, here we max dot png. Uh, fill. Wait, no, uh, it's gonna be called fill. Then add a child node sprite yeah. load a we max open transform by four. You're gonna import to uh, a we max filter off there. It's weird that like the highest priority thing has the um it's weird that like the highest priority thing has the um yeah is lower down instead of higher up as it is in normal stuff. You know what, let's say Alright, so here's what I'm gonna do, so Um, let's pull up the script. So I've got, um, what's the, um, punk, uh, let me pull up, so, the do timer, uh, what's the function? Um, so... What's the... Uh... What's the thing... Uh... Um... I know there's a word for it, so like, um... Let me just... Yeah, uh, the timer is gonna, like, calculate, um, when the AOE thing, when the, uh, I, under timer timeout? Uh, is that right? Oh, like, uh, a, like a cast yeah. time? Um, base, or, no, just like a timer, just in general, like, just something that will fire every X or whatever. Oh, like a repeater. Yeah. Yeah, like just 
Or like just it'll like count down for X amount of time and then I can like start it or again or whatever. Yeah. It's either a repeater or a looper. Yeah. Yeah, so Yeah, basically I can start or stop it whenever so it, a timer is the best name for it. But yeah. Um Um, AOE, still, oh, thank God. Stopwatch is another common name for it, yeah. Uh, so. Uh, then let's just bar running AOE equals true. Uh, running AOE equals true. So let's start it false. Then this will. Alright, then we're gonna have if running AoE. Let me just make sure, um, still. Scale, yeah, is a uh, vector too, I think, yeah. If running AoE, um,. Um, then var AOE scale equals O. Yeah, um, Gado, Gado, Sprite scale. Or actually, let me just pull up the Sprite class. Um, Sprite. So, Um, where's all right? So, what is scale parented from? Object. Um, all the waiting for Godot's clearly paid off. Hello, Polymnity. Yeah. How do I tell it, like, um, Godot, right, scale, yeah. Let me just pull this up, okay. Oh, it's ah, it's already a vector too. Okay. I have grown tired with destiny. <laughs> Fair. Yeah. Without any real content to do, there is no nothing I want. Mm -hmm. I, I lose interest quickly. Yeah. So. Yeah, um, then if AOE less than four, there, um, AOE, um, or AOE scale, yeah, 
fill dot scale equals AOE. Or no, uh, plus equals. Um, AOE fill dot scale. Yeah, I don't need. Yeah, so I don't need that. Yeah. Then. Else. Yeah. Running AOE equals false. Timer start. Ah! Why do you have physics? Hmm, terrifying. Yeah, Konami's pretty scary. <laughs> Alright, so... Ah! Corporate! Good? No! <laughs> um... Oh, what? It was masking with entities, weird. Alright, so... Three... Four... Five. Um. Let me. Um. Print. Starting. Or. I guess timer timeout is the wrong name for it. Um, Godot timer timeout function. Bear with me. All right. Um, what am I trying to do here? Um, Godot of life. Let me just pull this up real quick because I know I saw this elsewhere. Um, on timer timeout. Ah, okay. So, on timer timeout. Okay. That should be a. Does the timer need to be started? Uh, I am starting it in ready. Or, hi. Yeah, like, I'm. Yeah, um, so start, yeah. How about, um, you know, what I'm gonna do is running, yeah, um, is AOE E slash fill dot scale equals vector two O, comma, O. And it's going to start with running away AoE's true, okay. Ah! Vector 2, 4, comma, 4. Try that. <laughs> Oh wait, um... Okay. Setting AOE print. Oh. AOE build. All right. Ah. Yeah, just need to connect through um a signal. That's what should. That's 
to my knowledge, that's what on timer timeout should be doing for um, the signal stuff. The on methods are supposed to be synthetic. Right. Hmm. There we go. Uh Gado receive signal. Let me see, so Ah. Yeah, let me go over to timer. Actually, um, node, timeout, yeah. Don't think I'll start a dungeon that Next, late. yeah. Someone's having a fucking time with their car. <laughs> Alright. It's not me. Alright. <laughs> Three, four, five. Yay! Now it's working. Ooh. Oh, he's standing on it. Oh. Yeah, um, it does nothing if you stand on it right now. Ow! Nope, F. Actually, how about I make the timer, um, inspector? It'll be like one second, but yeah. Yay! And... Times. Ah. Cool boss, don't look at explosions. <laughs> God. Now why they was just it? Turn around and stare you down. Amazing. Mission complete. That right there is why you're the best boss. The one and only. Boss. Well, he's here. A lonely crab. <laughs> boss, you killed a child. <laughs> boss, you killed a child. I, I do like that person being able to pull that off is actually pretty talented because yeah. the input, because the um, requirements to get those two lines back to back is incredibly specific in its timing. All right, that's a lot better. Yay. <laughs> uh, can you connect it? I got that set up. Yeah. Very nice effect. Yeah. <clears throat> Speaking of killing children. All right. Yeah, I am. All right. It is like eight thirty-five. Okay. Nice. Still got plenty of time. I need to. I need to. I need to knock out a knock out a brat. I'm gonna rocket punch him. Oh, you're doing that mission again? Yes, because it's one of my favorites. How many how many times have you punched that kid in the face? Be honest. Uh, not enough. <laughs> oh, well, um... Okay. <laughs> you heard it here first, look, folks. Look, Eli is a little shit, and he deserves the... Yeah. <laughs> After everything he's done, and everything he continues <laughs> to do, despite the care people tried to give him, he kind of deserves it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yay, I've got at least a basic AoE. And I'm, I'm starting to understand why you ended the world a bunch of times. <laughs> to be perfectly fair, they started it. I didn't do anything. <laughs> they they, they and stole I the flames. I finished it. I did! Collision. Not the intended way, but it worked. Ugh, man. So get... It's gonna be very interesting to know your proxy. The proxy's not any different. It's just me using a different body from an... To so, physically interact with a um, timeline I can't come to. Mm -hmm. At first, she had her own. She had her own uh, personality, which was just a copy of my own. That's why she. Uh, that's why she chose uh, to not exist bar, when her mission was done. Uh, targets equals A O E. I should probably get. Swap my pistol to a stun one, actually. Get colliding bodies, okay. If funny in 
car gets sprint. Bunny got hit. All right. Rocket punch. Let's see if this just prints to the console. Oh, that's crashing. Okay. We're having uh -huh. some error. Um. Contact monitor. I should ah. myself. Look at my dog. My dog is perfect. Look at his little eye patch. <laughs> um. You always need an eye patch. Yeah, D Dog is the best character. Although I do like Quiet. Yeah, Quiet's pretty good. Extra hard mode if the raid makes it so getting hit crushes your game, God. Um. If you um, if you get Quiet in yeah, a Sniper Wolf uh, outfit, it's great. Is it called Sniper Wolf or is it Grey Wolf? I think it's Sniper Wolf. Alright, let's see how this goes. I want to reinstall the mods to have to play as a femme boss, but unfortunately I can't get that running again. I forgot ah. how to do it. Rip. Rip that machine. I mean, granted, femme boss literally just means, uh... Oh, actually, wait, no, I want to see, um... quiet, but that's fine. Mm -hmm. Actually, wait, um, how about I do... If... Bunny is um is oh. a lighting a we equalizing children print bunny Let got me get a boneless hit. couch. What? <laughs> Siona? I'm sorry? What? What? I mi what did I miss? Yeah. A boneless couch? Ah, that's, that's a crash. Called, that's that's oh. called a beanbag chair. Uh, <laughs> you're you're not wrong. Yeah. Okay, let <laughs> me. A boneless couch is basically like those inflatable couches that you used to get in like the early 2000s. The ones that you had in The Sims. Oh no. Nothing in The um, Sims is a good idea. I don't know what you're talking about. The bubble hookah is the best thing. I mean, okay, that's that that's valid only because I can imagine the goofiness you can have with that. Yeah, How do it's, you... it's great. Just four people seated around a hookah and bubbles um, are coming out. Is this like you know what it is? Good dough test position. <laughs> There's a reason they never brought oh. that back. It's only in the first six I... game, I think. Um. How about, um, is there, yeah, uh, now here's the question, is there a way to, like, just, uh, without, like, the actual, like, like, I want to, uh, do I want to use an Area 2D instead of, uh, let me check, um, Area 2D. Area 2D and what do you have? Um, oh, good. get get overlapping bodies. Yeah, so you're going to change type Area 2D. Um, so if bunny in if bunny in and we get. Lighting bodies, and you still have, yeah, you're still on the AoE collision layer, yeah. Ah, wait, no, overlapping, not fall asleep. Try them again. And 
cap. Um, now can I... Can I, uh, print... AoE get over clapping bodies. There he is. Why is that empty? Ah. Oh, wait. Um. Wait, do I now have to, uh, make it so Bunny is. As an Aoi's mask? Let's see. Yes. Alright, yay, that works. So now it's like detecting, hey, the bunny got hit. Woo. So, yeah, back over here. I can delete this because I'm just straight up not using it. But yeah. That, but yeah. Yeah, that is. Alright. I'm really happy with at least getting this far, like just. Yeah, like just, this is like printing out bunny got hit for me. Is that showing? Yeah, it is. Yeah, like just, you can see in the corner, it's like printing out bunny got hit. Ah. Uh, yeah, this is really good. Yay. And, uh... Dash, I'm less. Oh. So now, if you like dash, yeah, so now it should have like iframes. Yeah, so like, watch this. So, Bunny got hit. Oh. Ah. Yeah, so. <coughs> Now, if you dash out, yeah. <laughs> Shoot a man with a missile and a lawn chair. Yeah, so like I just now it should. I knocked out of lawn chair with my ro with my rocket arm. Yeah. Rocket man. <laughs> yeah, so like just now, if I Here's can. Time. Yeah, like just if you watch. If I dash it like the same time that um, it resets, yeah, like just you'll see, um, it's not like just when I do it right, uh, it has iframes now. Yay! Ah, uh, that's great. Like just this is honestly like more than I've gotten like done with like a game in ages so i'm really glad yeah. that like i've or like just with like making a game from scratch at least i've done a lot with you know, like just um gb studio has like a ton of like built-in stuff already so having like just this is all code that i wrote and is like just working on my stuff and i'm really really happy with that ah Ah, uh, I think I'm generally gonna wrap up for now. I'm getting a bit tired. This is. I have. Yeah. I have an excerpt that I think you would like. That I think uh, you can read when you're done streaming. All right, sounds good. I uh, I just I just put this one out. Nice. And yeah. it's, I would honestly say that it's one of the most, <laughs> like one of the most. I'd say that it's a very good sequence of characterization that nice. I've been trying yeah. to put in. Yeah, I'm really excited. Really yeah. Uh, Nikki, are you going to keep going for a little while longer? Yeah, I'm, right. I'm, I'm, in a, I'm in a stride right now. All right, yeah. I've written a thousand words. I feel pretty good. Yeah, I'm going to send everyone on over to you then. Mm -hmm. Here, we're just 
just hanging out to yeah. the music and whatnot. Uh, yeah, this has been really nice. Chat doing tonight? Uh, uh, yeah, I've been doing really. Yeah, I've been doing really good. I'm super happy with all the work I got done with tonight. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh. Oh, you okay? Almost. If he spoke Russian, this would be a Russian crow and badger. <laughs> oh, you. <laughs> But he speaks okay. Yeah, uh... Yeah, I think if he smoke Russian... <laughs> yeah, uh... Yeah, I'm just pretty much gonna wrap up. I'm getting a bit tired. Adderall seems to be running out a bit faster tonight. Not sure why. Oh well. Yeah, uh... I am very happy with what I've got done. Yeah, Alicia, Artemis, we should definitely start, like, working on, like, more planning stuff for this because... I'm having a lot of fun with this, and I would love to get it made. But yeah, uh, let's... Adderall, I hardly know her all. <laughs> uh, oh, nice. <laughs> yeah, since we're just sending over to Nikki, I don't think we're going to use a raid phrase tonight, since Nikki will be expecting it and has been here the whole time. What raid? I'm sorry? What? <laughs> yeah, uh, thank you all so very much for watching, hanging out, joining in. This has been really fun, really cozy. Uh, I've just had a nice time with it. Tomorrow is gonna be a very special. I hope y'all can tune in because it will be my one year anniversary of streaming. And Ooh. I've got some new stuff to show off. Gonna have a really fun time playing something. Not gonna... Sp yeah, actually, wait, no, I already said what it is. I'm gonna be playing Back for Blood with Nikki Riesel, Demon Queen Azazel, and Celadon. Gonna be fun. I can't wait for it. Got some new stuff to show off, which I will not be spoiling. And yeah, ah, uh, with that, I am gonna send y'all on over to Nikki. Oh, thank you for the last minute. Hydrate, Alicia. I really appreciate it. When we get over there, please don't forget to drop Nikki a follow because I love her a lot. Thank you, Nova, Nikki, and Jude for hanging out as usual. And yeah. Of course. Always a pleasure. Yeah, but with that, let's get going. I'm going to start this raid in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. See you soon!